Hello? They are here. Please let them in. We're waiting. Thank you. <sighs> Madam Chikilpa, I know this is an emotional day for you, and you have a lot to get off your chest. But I will advise that you let me take charge today. You know, the worst thing that can happen is for you to let your feelings and emotions get in the way of this already peaceful agreement. I don't know. Is it in your bag? My bag? Yes, now the audacity that you got or where you got it from to speak to me in that manner. <laughs> um, Vanessa, listen to me properly. All my life, I spent it listening to what I should do and what I should not do in my marriage. And look at where he has gotten me to. So please, God forbid, I'll be damned if I let the same thing happen in my divorce proceeding. Okay. See, see. So contrary to that nonsense that you said a few seconds ago, I'm in charge. Okay. Your job as your lawyer here is to listen, observe, and only give advice if I request for it. Otherwise, my darling, you zip it. Okay. Okay, no go. Okay, ma. Beautiful. Please come in. <laughs> mm. Of course. Chinya Rachel over. Ah, my bad. It's now a on one or two job. Okay. She called the American. Why am I not surprised? But you're good now. Eh? I thought that they said vampires only fly at night. So what are you doing here? Oh, you'll be in a better position to answer that question. When you go to your next coven of witches meeting, you'll be able with John Doty. <laughs> you understand? <laughs> Not a single surprise. Considering the fact that what? <laughs> your brother is a coward. I knew he wouldn't come for this. Oh, please. Chike went for a business meeting. And then he sent you to do his bidding? Nobody sent anybody. In fact, he wanted to postpone this meeting. Man, and then I was just like, okay, I can't wait to get this whole thing done and dusted. Mm. So let me just come and get it over with How once and for all. How thoughtful of you. Eh? How thoughtful of you, Ne? <laughs> mm. Sweetheart, mm. you don't know how long I have been holding my breath, waiting for this moment mm -hmm. to come. I said it. No wonder you always look so pale, Nen. I almost thought it was just you know your cosmetic surgeries that cost uh, your skin to start fading off. Hey! But my darling, I, I give you permission. You can breathe. Breathe, Biko. For God, hold in my breath. Chinyere, you know, I don't understand what your problem is. It's amazing how you talk so much. Considering the fact that you have little or no education. Yes! The way you run your mouth, you think that is going to save you today? When I am done with you, if you mess Tata, you will lose. My darling, it's a divorce settlement, not a football I can choose to make it whatever I want it to be for someone boy. Yes, now, I keep forgetting. You're an OG now. Isn't this your what? Seventh? Tenth? Divorce settlement? Oh, so you know. So that will make you understand that I am not the person who will walk out of this place with my tail between my legs. When I'm done with you, you will go back to your father's house empty handed, poverty stricken, without any of my brother's money or belongings the way you came. When you're not. Oh, no. Pleasure to meet you, Mrs. Amefuna. My name is Vanessa. I am Mrs. Chikilubar's lawyer. Hey! <laughs> Look at my face. Oh. What have I done with myself? <laughs> Bonaventure. Hmm. I can now see the reason you've not been picking my call. Clearly, you've chosen a side. Okay. With due respect, Madam Gold, I work for your husband and not you. Bam. <laughs> um, let's all be calm. Mm. I'm sure we have other engagements slated for today. So the earlier we get started, the better for everyone. Beautiful, my darling. Okay, we have prepared a list of assets for consideration, as well as how we believe they should be shared in a way that would satisfy every party involved. First on the list, we have landed properties. 
So I have assessed the value of all the properties and I believe a 60-40 sharing formula would be best with my clients, Mrs. Chikuluba, um, receiving 60% of all the properties in Lagos, Abuja, Port Harcourt, Los Angeles, Johannesburg, Tokyo, and Japan. Hmm. I see. And where is the gun? Sorry, gun? Where is the gun or the knife that you're using for this daylight work? I'm sorry. No, 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 no. She's just being so cross. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. I don't know the one that I find most amusing. Whether that you're educated enough to use the word sarcastic or that you're dumb enough to think I'm going to allow you to walk away with 60% of my brother's properties. Oh, please. Please calm down, ma. I purchased these properties. I was the one traveling to oversee the construction. Every single one of them. Hmm. Yes. And so, when you were running up and down, burning the resources, whose money was that? Yours? <laughs> Let's be calm. Mm. Madam, this is a negotiation. Tell us, what is your offer? <laughs> and why are you asking her? Eh? Bobo, the floor is yours. Okay. <clears throat> so, um, our offer is five cents. Yeah! <laughs> so like I was saying, our offer is five percent. Miss Chikeluba is going to be taking five percent of Mr. Chike's um, properties, including the house in Anamba. I beg like your pardon. It is that begging. Quick for that begging. Chinyere, it is that begging that has brought you to the point where you are. Chinyere, when will you get up and walk? When will you get up and walk for your money? Also, also like your mates. I'm so sorry, but this cannot work for us. 5% is too insignificant. And we all know the house in Anambra is an uncompleted building. That's really not our business. <laughs> you just have to make it work. <coughs> no, I'm okay. On adventure. <laughs> you know what? Mm. Let's put a pause on this for now and move to other agenda. Gladly. <laughs> financial and uh, financial asset and shares, I guess. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Is this a joke? <laughs> no, that's a legal document. I bet you didn't finish those. That 5% you see there is us being very magnanimous. Mm -hmm. that, yes, that is the height of our generosity. Considering the fact that this your greedy clients will not get a leak. She doesn't have a right ah. to anything that pertains to my brother's money. <laughs> Considering that she's the one calling for this divorce. Mm. Yes. Even at that, 2% two, two of the assets and 0% shares, it, it, it doesn't make sense. <laughs> Our money. And Nanam, our money. Yes, sir. Yes. You keep saying Chike's money, Chike's money. That money belongs to both I and Chike. You think Chike will be where he is today if not for the suffering that I had to go through while he pursued his career? Mm -hmm. Those long nights I had to take care of the children and help him react to speech to investors. Or oh, see the advices I gave him when he wanted to give up. And you sit there and tell me Chike's money. What am I making to sit? Hey, hey, hey. Nah, eh. You don't even just sit to abuse me. Chile, Eh? Were you suffering? Yeah. Were you suffering? Did Chicken not take care of you? Chicken made your life better than you. Ah. You have a better life now than what you used to be. You have a better life now than whatever you ever had. Chicken, my sacrifices. And this is why Chicken is where he is today. Did anybody force you to make sacrifices? Anamajuke, did they force you to make any sacrifices? You were just doing your duties as a wife. Oh, Nya, yeah, you want us to party on your back, Abi? Nya, yeah, I only give this salary because you did your wifely duties. Hey, General, and your sister. My friend, give them the next one. Let's go to the next um, agenda. The children. Hmm? Yes. Did you say the children? The children. Bonaventure. What about the children? Um, uh, okay. So, um, Mr. Chike, Chike Loba. Yes. It's going to be taking full custody of the children. Oh, yes. While um, you would... Um, You must really think I'm a fool. <laughs> I'm happy that you said it. 
I never wanted it to come out of my mouth in the first place. Mm. But truly, I do. Now, game on to your phone now. Those children are the only useful thing that came out of this sorry excuse of a marriage. I put my mouth and God for me. Check out when you job. I don't ever agree to such thing. Even my children will not agree. <laughs> Fair they will not. Fair question, but in your job. Not when I tell them how you want to ruin this happy home that you people once shared. I will tell them that you are the one that called for this divorce. You want to break their happy home out, yeah? Yes! That you are the one calling for a divorce just because of a very petty mistake that their father made. Petty mistake? Oh, yes. It's not a petty mistake, she called. Petty mistake, okay? Uh -huh. In our point for your brother, Mary, petty mistakes, okay? Obele and Joe. Yes! Okay. What's the bad What did he do? Mikono, eh? What did Chike do? You said he was um, siphoning, not siphoning, he was moving money away from your joint account without telling you. Oh. And I ask. So that's all he told you? Oh yes, what else did he do? Ah. And I actually blame him. I blame him. Because which money are you even talking about? Money that you did not make. Why should he be taking permission from you before moving money from his own account? Or can have only a joint account? Eh? <laughs> it's his fault. If he had put you in your place at the beginning of this marriage, you will not have the guts. No, I have a It's because he did not put you in your place. You wouldn't have the guts to come here and talk nonsense. That's why all this rubbish is going on. I can't get it. Check out. You're right. She can take money out of our joint account without telling me. Hmm, he also did other things. But did he tell you what the money was? What was it for? Mm hmm. Imaro. Eh? And that is why you will never amount to anything in your entire life. It is your useless life. What do I do? Yes, because all you care about is stirring up drama and nothing, not even the truth. Yeah. Just drama. You are learning from the counter. The money was for your life. Babe, I'm And you were talking about the one you had, Miss. That is the baby number before. The first one. Man. Hey! I don't know what that means. What did you do? Chicken. Chicken like your brother. Had a son for six years outside marriage. Oh, yes. Your new nephew. Yes. And how did I find out? I'm pretty in my parlor on a beautiful day. And some slut walks into my house and tells me that what? Chicken. Chicken. And I have a son somewhere. Ah! Apparently, the woman wanted to use it to open private school for the boy. Whatever she said, the reason was. So can't you again? Is this still a petty mistake? Ah, okay. Do you know the reason why your brother wasn't here today? Okay, you think it was any nonsense trip, my darling? Because Chicken Chicken could not face me in the face. He was too embarrassed to do so. Hey! Chinyeli Diego. Hey! 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 You know, I cannot understand. I wish Chicken was actually here to see you fabricate this kind of terrible lies that you're lying. It's not fair. Put a call through to him now. Kita, kita. Call him now. Do I know ya? Call him. You know what? I'm going to call Chicken, not because you said so. Okay. But for him to just listen to you and hear you vomit these lies. Lies are no one that you're vomiting you're here. You're wasting time. Call him. Call him. Call me call Chicken. I got the aircon. So bad, bro. And just watch Kita. <laughs> Hello, Chike. No, 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 Chike. Why didn't you tell me? You should have told me beforehand now. Eh? Why do you like disgracing our family name everywhere? Chike Okine Kwando, what is wrong with you? No, 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 don't sister me. Don't sister me at all. You should have just told me. You just go around everywhere spreading your seed anyhow. What is the problem? Ah! Okay. Fine, let me just tell her. And let me give her the phone. Hello, Chicken. I'm here. He wants to talk to you privately. Please. Whatever he wants to say, he can say in front of everybody. It is on the speaker. Let's have it. Let's have it. Okay, Chike, she wants me to put the phone on speaker. I've put you on speaker. Okay. Uh, uh, Chike, uh, hello, everybody. Good day, sir. Good afternoon, Mr. Chike. Um, first, I want to apologize for putting everybody in this situation. Uh, especially my wife, Chike. Uh, I'm so sorry for keeping this secret from you. I, I was so afraid that you would leave me if you found out. 
I wanted to tell you, but the longer it took, the harder it became. Yes, Yoko. And so your solution was lying to me, huh? Did you ever think I would not find out that you had a child outside marriage? Chicken. She is not my child. <laughs> Can I do I say? Okay, for now. And you're still lying, eh? Clearly you've not learnt your lesson. No, 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 Chicken. No more for my sake. You don't understand. I had my husband to do a DNA test a week ago. The result just came in. He's not my son. And what about a DNA test of six years ago? It was fake. She faulted it because the real father was some dog that didn't have money, so she faked it. I've sent the real DNA result to Good Adventure to show you, huh? Che, she deceived me, Junior. I swear I'm not the father of that boy. Well, it still doesn't change the fact that she lied to me, Chiki. I'm sorry. It's too late. I know, I know, I'm sorry, eh? but please, don't allow this mistake I made years ago to destroy our relationship and our family because, you know, ah. Uh... Take it, take it, Biko. Your sorry is too late. Biko, stop apologizing. Yeah, so you still want to get a divorce? Well, maybe not a divorce, but a trial separation. Separation, Kwa? Yes. Chinye, that's too much. It won't work. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay. You still think that you're in the position to be choosing and picking up, right? Well, okay, okay, okay. Uh, trial separation for how long? I don't know. One year, two years, three years, four years, five years, I don't know. Yes! I don't know. Till I'm ready to get back to whatever this nonsense is called. Of course, I still have my conditions. I'm not going to anything you want, anything you want, Ching. Consider it done. Yeah, Chike, what is the problem? Eh? Can you for why are you allowing this girl, this lady to push you up and down? Why are you allowing her? Ah! This girl will suck you dry, you. I'm warning you, Naida and Ifeo. Sister, with all due respect, eh? I know you're only looking out for me. But please, Biko, mind your business. Chicky, <laughs> chicky. I would help you. Put it back on. Yes. Help you there. I know, chicken. <laughs> chicken. Mba, no, mba, oh bro, no. Oh bro, your fault. Ah. Yeah, now I'm not in their business, Mabi. Oh bro, no, 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 that's a bad word. It's not your fault. Oh bro, your fault. Mm. Anyways, mm. Mm. you must be very happy now, Akin. You're very, very proud of yourself. Yeah. So you have another 10 years yes. to eat from where you did not sow. To collect money that never belonged to you. Just like the blood sucking leech that you are. I pay no attention to fools. Speak to your brother. Anyways, my darlings, eh? as it is, I still have my conditions, like I said. Vanessa, please, hand it over to me. <clears throat> it seems a little confused. Would you like to enlighten me? Um, this is a separation agreement, or were you not taught at your law school in Ikurudu? You were on our job. Okay. Number one. No more for me. I'll be taking all his landed property. Every single one of them, nothing less. By taking all these properties, I mean I want to work to every single one of them. Ah! Two, he can have the family house. I'm not using it for anything. Three, hmm. and listen to this particular part properly. I want half of his investment shares and half of his company in my name. Hey! Forward these terms to him. Tell him we're waiting for his response. <laughs> I'm sure my brother will not be so stupid to listen to all those your wine. Okay. Even in our queen. He said he's a beer. Eh? Now give me. <laughs> oh, check out the amif now. Give me my amif now. Ah, give me it. Chief of God, I know your brother. I have married him for thirty years. I know your brother, Chike Chike the brother. He's the epitome of stupidity. <laughs> You should be aware of this now, eh? It's a sickness that runs in your family, okay? Yes! You should know this now. You broke your heart. I got the queen cut. The pale skin of yours. Hey! <clears throat> Lady and gentlemen, as per the request of my client, Miss Onatsujo, formerly known as Mrs. Chikeluba, the divorce proceeding shall continue. But at a later date, which we shall come it's been a complete displeasure seeing you once again. 
Get off again. Get your go. You want to venture? See, I have no space for snakes in there. Well, Adam, I don't you think that you can still work for chicken. If I were you, I would do it to my resume. Because trust me, you don't have work here anymore. Yes! You know I can do it. Are you ready? Now we can see who really lost. 